Hello, my name is Emma and in today's video I am going to teach you all about laughing, funny uh, jokes, and comedy. I'm going to teach you specifically expressions we can use when we hear a joke or when we watch a funny movie or when something funny happens. So the lesson for today is titled LMAO, talking about comedy, ha ha ha. All right, so uh, first off, LMAO, I don't know if you've ever seen this, but this is something people write on the internet. It's the same as LOL. This means laugh my ass off. And we use this when we find something very, very funny. So let me teach you uh, first about the words fun and funny, and then we will get into these expressions. So the first thing I wanted to teach you, fun versus funny. This is probably one of the number one mistakes I, I see students make. Oh, teacher, it's so fun. Oh, teacher, it's funny. What's the difference? Um, fun is not used for ha ha ha. Fun is used when we're talking about something that is exciting and that makes us happy. So for example, um, I like sports. Sports are fun, sports are exciting, sports make me happy. This is different from the word funny. So funny means it makes you laugh. Uh, the TV show, The Big Bang Theory. To me, when I watch that, I laugh, it's funny. Um, when I watch comedies, when I watch funny movies, I laugh, so they are funny. Okay, so this is a, a very big difference between these two. Uh, so very important, you know the difference between funny and fun. We have here the word LOL. I'll just explain what this means very quickly. LOL is something we also use on the internet, similar to LMAO. It means laugh out loud. Okay, so when you see something funny on the internet, you can write LOL and it means you think it's funny. So let's look at some expressions uh, that we can use when we find something funny. The first expression, uh, and actually I'm gonna add something here. Ha ha ha, okay, it's important. Okay, so the first expression here, it's funny, means this happens. You see something, oh, it's funny, ha ha ha. The second one has the same meaning, it's hilarious. Okay, so this means it's funny. Um, when I think about actors, Jim Carrey, Mike Myers, these guys to me, I think they're hilarious. Uh, so I want you to try the, pr the pronunciation of this word, hilarious. The stress, the part that's loud, there, hilarious. I want you to think about something in your own life that you think is very funny. What's something that's hilarious? Maybe you've seen a TV show, maybe YouTube videos, all right? Think about something that's hilarious. We can also use this expression, it made me laugh. Okay, so this means you saw something, it was funny, it made you laugh. We have, like I said before, laugh my ass off. This is what we use when we're writing something on the internet. We can also use it with an F, which uh, is a little bit ruder. It means laugh my fucking ass off. Uh, if you laugh your ass off, it means you found something hilarious. It means you found something very, very funny. We also have this, I burst out laughing. This means suddenly you start laughing, okay? So you're serious and suddenly, ha 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 ha, okay? You burst out laughing. It's sudden laughter. We also have the word, it cracks me up. If something cracks you up, so it can be anything, it means the same thing as it made me laugh. Um, for me, uh, cat videos on YouTube, they crack me up. I laugh when I watch cat videos, they crack me up. Um, different movies crack me up. Uh, the Three Stooges, I guess, crack me up, okay? So crack me up means it makes me laugh. Finally, uh, the last one, 
I couldn't stop laughing. I couldn't stop laughing. Has there ever been a situation that you found so funny, you laughed and laughed and laughed? For those situations, we say, oh, I couldn't stop laughing. So all of these we use when we're very happy and we find something, ha ha ha, we find something funny. All right, now we also have words we use when we don't understand a joke. A lot of the times you'll hear an English joke, maybe you're watching a TV show, and everyone around you is laughing, but you don't understand why. You don't know what's so funny, you can say, I don't get it. I don't get the joke, okay? It means I don't understand. When I was learning French, a lot of jokes I did not get. Everybody would laugh, I'd watch a movie, everybody would be laughing, I didn't get it. So get here means the same as understand. All right, we'll come to this later. Um, now we have when somebody tells you a joke and you don't really like the joke, or maybe you're watching a movie and you don't think it's funny. So this is for, okay, something's not funny. So what we can say here, you can say, it's not funny. Um, if a joke or something, somebody else finds it very funny, but you are just like, come on, are you serious? This isn't funny. You can say it's lame. Okay, so these are usually what we say about bad jokes. If somebody tells you a joke and you just, okay, it means it's lame. You can also say this, it's corny. Corny is kind of like when um, something is, is very, it's, it's a joke that's really, really not funny. Maybe children will laugh, but adults won't. It's really not a funny joke. Um, if somebody tells a joke or you watch a, a movie and it's supposed to be funny, but nobody's laughing, you can say it bombed. So bomb is a verb. It means it's a very bad joke, it bombed. Um, finally, we have some jokes that uh, people will say, some people might find funny, but to other people, it's not that the joke is just bad, it makes them feel very angry, okay? So maybe this is a joke about um, somebody's race, maybe it's a joke about uh, somebody's religion. So these are jokes uh, we say, that joke, it's offensive. Offensive means it makes us angry and it offends us. You can also say a joke is awful, it's terrible, it's horrible, okay? Um, the last thing I wanted to teach you is about something called a dirty, dirty joke. When we talk about dirty jokes in English, some people find them funny, some people find them horrible, so I put it in the middle here. Dirty jokes are jokes about sex. So if somebody says, I have a dirty joke for you, it means I have a joke about sex I'm going to tell you, okay? So now I am going to tell you some jokes. I'm not gonna tell you any dirty jokes, and I don't think any of these jokes are offensive. Uh, maybe they are, I, I don't think so, but I'm going to tell you some jokes. What I want you to do is after each joke, I want you to use one of these expressions and tell me what you think about it. Okay, so this is partially a listening exercise. So you're going to listen for the joke. After that, I want you to say out loud. So talk to your computer. I want you to say, uh, if you laughed, one of these expressions, if you don't understand this, and if you hated the joke, one of these. Okay, so let's get started. My first joke, why is six afraid of seven? So why is six afraid of seven? Because seven, eight, nine. Pretty much, okay. Uh, so tell me what you think. Use one of these expressions. Did you burst out laughing? I, I bet you can't stop laughing. <laughs> and here are some, some people would say that's lame, it's corny, okay? Okay, the next joke. I actually haven't read these for a long time, so I'm kind of surprised by some of them. Uh, the next joke, 
What type of cheese is not yours? What type of cheese is not yours? Nacho cheese. Okay, nacho cheese is the joke. So again, is it one of these? One of these. All right, tell me how you think about that joke. All right, my next joke. The past, present, and future all walked into a bar. So the past, the present, and the future all walked into a bar. It was tense. All right, again, I want you to respond. What did you think of that joke? It was tense. Okay, my next joke. <laughs> Two fish are in a tank. One fish turns to the other fish and says, how do you drive this thing? Okay, again, feel free. <laughs> All right, my next joke, and uh, don't worry, I'm almost finished in case you think, oh, teacher Emma, she's so corny. These are so lame. She's bombing these jokes. They're awful. They're not funny, okay? So in case you're, all of them have been this, or I don't get it, we're almost finished, don't worry. Um, the next joke, how do you organize a space party? How do you organize a space party? You plan it. All right. My final joke of the day. Why did the right triangle go to the beach? Why did the right triangle go to the beach? It was 90 degrees. Badoomch. All right, so there you have it. A bunch of new jokes for you to use with your friends. Uh, if you think they're funny, if you think these jokes are lame and corny, you can forget them, forget they even exist. Um, but try to use these expressions. They're useful. We use them all the time in English. Uh, I hope you have enjoyed this video. I hope you have laughed your asses off. I hope you've cracked up. I hope I've made you laugh. Um, I hope you can't stop laughing because this is so funny. And I hope you found everything I said today hilarious. Um, so you can practice these expressions on our website at www.ingvid.com. Uh, there, there's going to be a quiz. Uh, you can check the vocabulary, make sure uh, you understand the definitions and how we use these words. Until next time, take care.